What's up, y'all? Shannon Nicole here with another video for you. This is gonna be uh, my Victoria's Secret collection. Um, it's gonna have a mixture of like different mists and also some perfumes in here too. I have about a total of three tubs I'm going to get through, filled, and then some extra stuff on the side. So before, like I always used to be at the semi-annual sale. So a lot of these, I mean, I probably purchased one perfume full price, which was the biggest mistake I've made. Um, then after that, I saw it go on sale on the um, semi-annual sale. So that's basically where most of these items are purchased from. Unless it's like a sale or they go down to like $6, I do not go and splurge on any of this stuff and spend like $18 for one miss. I refuse. I will not. So one of the reasons why my collection is so big is because I enjoy smelling good. And I like having a variety of perfumes and body mists to, you know to indulge in and smell good from. Um, so, yeah. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started, done rambling, and I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what I got. So, alright. Alright, so I'm going to start off with the ones with the gold caps. Let's... Actually, it's going to be random. Just, you're going to see them. Alright, so the first one is going to be Forbidden Berries. I don't know if you can see that. Victoria's Secret Temptation. This one is one of the new ones. Victoria's Secret T Santorini Norelli, Norelli Water. This one is my favorite and I have a total of three of them. Probably had a total of four. Um, I'm really bad at, you know, just using what I have. Because, like, I'll use it and then I can't find it. So all three of these are basically halfway so I'm gonna say I have one and a half of these so this is the rush you can see how much I've used it I this is like I love this they just made a new packaging for these and I don't think I'm gonna like it that much like it's I don't know I'm gonna have to buy it and see so there's two and there's three they're probably all just about used up to the same amount and I have banana twist I have two of these these are my favorite they smell really good and, and I never thought that I'd be the one walking around like smelling like a like a food item i never really liked it like that but here i am and i'm in love with the banana twist then i have bare vanilla this is noir i'm sorry i don't know how to say it bare vanilla noir this one is the victoria's secret marine splash this one is crushed petals as you can tell i use this a ton another bare vanilla noir is bare vanilla shimmer and is the tropic cool this one love addict um i feel like i was obsessed with this at one point and then i just stopped and moved on this one bare vanilla as you can tell i love vanilla that's like my go-to scent um it's almost down to the bottom uh victoria's secret bright palms this one is the crushed petals This one, another one of my go-to's, Amber Romance. This one is, hmm, this one is Neon Palms. This one is Electric Beach. This one is the Victoria's Secret Santorini Norelli Waters. Really love this one too. It's like a really fresh, clean scent. Um, that's why I have two of them. And then I have another Amber Romance. So these ones are going to be the perfumes, the body mist that, that stem from the perfumes, which would not be as strong, but they do last a pretty, pretty decent time. I love the Tease line. This one is Tease Heartbreaker. This one I left in my car for a little bit, but this one is just the Tease perfume. It's a little plus size, you know what I'm saying? It kind of blew up a little bit, but still smells the same, still smells good. This one is Love Me, another one that um, left in my car. This is Victoria's Secret um, Bombshell Holiday. This is Victoria's Secret Forever Sexy. It's a regular bottle, kind of has like a lace kind of look in the back. This one is Victoria's Secret Crush. I think this was one of my favorites. This one is Victoria's Secret Tees, another one. Almost done. This one is Forever Sexy again. This is the Bombshell Paris. I feel like I had, 
I bought this and the perfume too. I think I finished it. Oh, there it is. It's right here. The Bombshell Victoria's Secret Paris is just about done if you look at it from the side. Next, I got two of the Chase and Sub, uh, Sunsets. This one, I think, came out around like one of the spring break times. This one is a rush that I finished. Probably going to take this top and put it on one of this one. Put it on this Amber Romance, and that's why I still have it. So I might as well just do that now so I can throw this one away. Hi. Um, the next one is Dark Floral. I think I was in love with this at one point. I don't know. This one is Warm and Cozy. The next one is Fresh and Clean. When I fell in love with Fresh and Clean, I was in high school. That was when they had, like, the square bottles. And then they even had, like, the square, like, lotion. And it was, like, drenched in whatever. So that's what made me fall for this. Um... These ones I use to like spray around the house. These are the old, old, old bottles. Endless Love. And then this one is Sheer Water Lily. Oh my god. This one is Sheer Water Lily Summer Freshes. This is that. This one is the very sexy Shimmer. Shimmer Mist. Alright, this one is one of the perfumes that I paid full price for. It is XO Victoria. Um, I think it came with like a lotion or something like that or maybe a body, I don't know what it came with but um, I paid full price for it and this is, after buying this is when I was like okay I'm only buying them for the semi-annual sale because I've seen how cheap they go. I like the bow in here, I just like how fancy it looks, it has like a floral scent as you can tell it has all the flowers on it but this one is probably one of my favorites for the bottle, the smell, I don't know but there's that one. This one is from the pink collection. It's called Everything Nice. This one is another old one, which is Body Mist with Shea Essence. So I also use this to spray around the house when I'm done cleaning. Now, this one is Supermodel, and I'm almost done with it. There's probably like maybe like 10 sprays left in here. And then I also got the backup to Supermodel. And I'm probably halfway done with this one. That's how much I like this. Now, backstory on Supermodel is I got this in high school. And I think I got the body mist. I don't think they had came out with the spray yet. I'm not sure. But I know I have the body mist. And then when I saw this again, I'm not sure when it came out again. But I had bought the body mist maybe about three years ago. I bought Supermodel online when I saw it come out for the semi-annual sale. This perfume, just, I can't even explain it. It's just... It literally, I, I, I can't even explain it. It's just the smell to it. It just makes you feel just, I don't know. I just know this is a definite pickup, a definite must buy. It just, it just, even the bottle has a statement to it. So, look at the box. Like, are you serious? It's just my favorite. Next one is Victoria's Secret Bombshell Holiday. This is what it is, probably one of the most recent ones. I like the packaging. It is so cute. So, is that? I'm not even sure if I sprayed this one ever. No, I did. Hmm. Just a little reminder of why I like it. But this is this is it. The next one. Mmm. Victoria's Secret Tees, but this one is in the little travel size package. This one is the Oh So Sexy. I feel like I fell in love with this at one point. I feel like I fall in love, like I have spurts of when I love stuff and then I don't love it no more. And then I stop using it, so yeah, that's why a lot of my stuff is like half used. But there's that. My last things that I'm going to show you are the sprays. Um, these are the Glitter Lust. Are they all Glitter Lust? Yeah, Glitter Lust Sprays. This one is in Tease Rebel. And it's basically just a spray with glitter in it. This one is very sexy. <laughs> this one is oh so sexy. And then the last one is Tease. Let's see. Spray it a little bit so you see how it comes off. 
I guess you can't really see it. There we go. I probably put oil underneath it before I spray it. Never used these before, but I just wanted to show you for the camera how it glitters a little bit. So it's not bad. Okay. Ooh. It definitely has a very strong smell, like an after smell. It smells really good. Hmm. Now I feel like I gotta go somewhere. <laughs> There's nowhere to go. Alright, so that's everything that I have for this video. That was my collective um, Bath and Body Works perfumes along with the body mist. So go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Um, I really enjoyed uh, making the video for you guys. And um, my next video will probably be just my Bath and Body Works ones. This video is already drawn out long enough. It's been like 18, it's on like 1851. <sighs> Basically right now before editing is like almost 20 minutes. So I didn't want to include my Bath and Body Works along with this stuff. But anyways, that's it. That's all I have for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and put a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, and definitely share this video. So, you know, just just, just show me some love. Show me lots and lots of love. So, once again, Shana Cole, and I'm out.